Hi everyone, and welcome to After School, a brand new podcast project from Simon Fraser University's Faculty of Communication, Art, and Technology. In this very first preview episode, you're going to get to hear snippets from a few of our upcoming conversations with SFU FCAT alumni. Here at After School, students from across our faculty speak with alumni about their career journey since graduation and gather advice for the next generation. Are you wondering what path to take at the end of your degree? Are you curious about past student experiences? Interested in learning more about the FCAT community? After School invites you into candid conversations with FCAT alumni in both traditional and unconventional career paths across communication, interactive arts and technology, contemporary arts, publishing, and digital media. We would like to respectfully acknowledge the Musqueam, Squamish, Tsleil-Waututh, Katsi, Coquitlam, Kakat, Kwantlen, Semiama, and Tawasin peoples whose unceded traditional territories our three campuses reside. We hope you will enjoy all the upcoming episodes where we will be featuring interviews from our diverse and engaging alumni guests, such as our first guest, Prem Gill, the CEO of Creative BC, a provincial organization focused on supporting British Columbia's creative sector. And certainly my path professionally has not been linear in the sense that, you know, when I was graduating from school, I would never have written down that my future goal is to be the CEO of Creative BC. Definitely wanted to be connected to or working within the media sector. Uh, I didn't see people like myself represented in front of the camera or behind or stories being told, whether it was in magazines or newspapers or wherever else. So I didn't fully have a vision, but I knew that this is what my goal was to somehow always be involved in this area. We'll also have the opportunity to hear from Errol Kapoor, a multidisciplinary performer and director across theatre, dance and film. His work has shown across Canada, including at the Canada Dance Festival, Dancing on the Edge Festival, and Revolver Festival. Uh, I basically think film and video is different from from performance because the language is different, the medium is different, right? People came to live performance because they wanted to do live performance. Mm -hmm. And video and film is another medium. And so many people think they're similar. Like, actually, uh, I like to connect it to SFU, the formation and the organism that SFU is, like how people cross-pollinate. There Mm -hmm. has been more cross-pollination, in my experience at SFU, between theater and dance than it was between theater and cinema. But it was just interesting to see that. Maybe it has something to do with the architecture of the building because on fourth floor, most of theater theater and and dance dance together. together. I don't think if theater is any closer to any of them. I think we have overlaps kind of equally, whatever that means. And yet another wonderful alumni guest we'll be featuring is Sofia Bautista, head of product at Legible, a browser-based reading and publishing platform. Coming from a design design training really helps you figure out what it takes to uh, fully flesh out a project or a product in general. Um, And when, you know, designers and developers are busy building the thing, someone has to think about what to build. Episodes featuring these guests plus many more SFU FCAT alumni will soon be available. Make sure you subscribe to After School in your podcast app of choice so you don't miss these or any of our other amazing upcoming interviews. And go ahead and follow us on social media with our handle FCAT at SFU. That's F-C-A-T at SFU on Twitter and Instagram. We'll see you next time.